suppliers, when they invest badly, sometimes lose money. That's her first problem. Your second problem is even greater. What I want you to do is look at those contracts, the ones that you've signed. I also understand that I will receive an extra, and it says various things. Uh, I'll receive money for petrol and diesel, right? Is that for getting to their business yeah. to supply the... How much did you spend on diesel and petrol that you haven't been paid for? All together. I've been there five times. Okay. Five times. It's fine. I just needed to know. I also understand that I will receive an extra £15 for petrol for delivery. Now, here's the essential thing. I, Alexandra, agree that I'm not receiving any upfront payments and that I understand that any payments will be received from those two on the 30th of September, contract two. That any payments I receive will be on the 30th of November. That's months away from now. Yes. They're not even legally, according to the contract you signed, with no diligence, now they've gone bust. You're not legally entitled to sue on that contract because they're not yet in breach, correct? Yes, but if the shop yes. got closed... If the shop closed, what? They're obviously not going to sell any more dresses if the shop got closed. They might not. 